Exodus chapter 30 is another altar. This one's a different one. This is the altar of incense, where the incense would be lit and the, you know, the smell, the aroma, the smoke would rise up to God. It's a beautiful picture of prayer, how our prayers rise up to God and touch the heart of God. And so this is symbolic of prayer. The high priest would light the incense, he would sprinkle the blood on the horns, and there's this amazing picture of, you know, God offering us a sacrifice, prayers going up to him. So the priest would light the incense, put blood on the horns of the altar, and it's a picture. It's, it's symbolic of, you know, the blood of Christ and prayer going up and how we pray in the name and the authority of Jesus Christ. It's only because of his blood that we can approach the Father and our prayers of sin to the Father. And this is the picture of the altar of incense. Not only is it just about prayer that touches God's heart, but it's also about the blood that opens God's heart to you and I. And this altar of incense would be daily and prayer is to be daily. And the incense was rise immediately. So there's a lot going on here. There's the blood, there's the prayer, there's the daily prayer, the immediate access to God, the importance of prayer. All this is found here in Exodus chapter 30. If you want a wonderful, symbolic, beautiful picture of how God hears our prayer, receives our prayer, well, Exodus chapter 30. Listen, the altar of incense all about our prayers coming to God through the blood of Jesus Christ.